We currently find ourselves in a period of mourning. The days between Passover and Lag Ba'omer, 33 days, are used to reflect upon the students of Rabbi Akiva. 24,000 students of Rabbi Akiva were killed by a mysterious plague during these days. As such, we mourn. We don't have haircuts and we generally don't shave. No live music, no celebrations are held. The question is asked, when it comes to all the days you remember crusades and pogroms and the Holocaust, inquisitions, anti-Semitism, we don't have any mourning restrictions. Why is that? That for the rabbinical students we observe all kinds of aspects of mourning, but for crusades and inquisitions, we don't. And the answer is explained, is that the 24,000 students at Rabbi Akiva die because they didn't respect one another. Said Rabbi Akiva, this is one of the most fundamental principles of the entire Torah. Can you imagine the great rabbi who taught that loving your fellow as you love yourself, respecting others? His students died during this time. And that's why it's such a great tragedy that we have to have certain warning restrictions. We could disagree, we can have different opinions, but we can never forego the biblical requirement to love your fellow as you love yourself. Because once disrespect takes over, disregard, arrogance, society falls apart. But when we respect each other and respect the other person's view and opinion, we build society, we build the Jewish people. So let's take these days of mourning and reflect upon what caused them disrespect and fix ourselves to show unconditional love to everyone we meet, regardless if we agree with them or not.